Okay, today I'm gonna do showcase a bit of how I read uh -oh. and take notes in Zotero and Obsidian. So actually, I am preparing for a architect exam for an architect exam in Taiwan. So this is my PDF of the book regulations in, um, in Taiwan and uh, when I read something I think that is worthy of memorizing I will try to stop and then recap or rethink again of how I just read and type it here by myself okay let's find some highlights here mm. For example, this one, and I'll press this and highlight it so you will memorize here for the Zotero highlights. And uh, I have to, if I think it's important, I can use this to create a line here. more clear a, a clearer memory of this highlight okay and uh, I'll show you why I try to make the separation in the documents because once I want to have a presentation or to memorize mem uh, more cl uh, clearer I can use advanced slides Okay. Use sliding paint. Now I can. Um, this is the highlights I just made, and I can use this way to have the um, highlights put it into my advanced slides and share with others really quickly uh, if you have this kind of picture that is too large you can shrink it by by using this way okay this one is the shrink one so basically I type the uh, size at the bottom yeah, I can actually control it. So it's super good. You can have pipe type of pipeline and uh, for example 500. Okay, you can bring the um, picture image and then you can see here automatically reload. So it's super useful when you're trying to prepare for your um, personal readings you can try this you made presentation and you make highlights and uh, you also make highlights in Zotero that you can take or review it in Zotero when you are using your iPad yeah. so that's it for today thank you